This video is about Harley Whitehead from Blackburn in Lancashire. Harley is a certified British EOD technician who saves lives by supporting the Ukrainian Volunteer Army with mine clearing operations. EOD stands for Explosive Ordnance Disposal. When Russia invaded Ukraine on 24th February 2022, Harley was a Kiev resident having moved to Ukraine in 2019. When the war in Ukraine started, Harley founded the East Lanks for Ukraine charity, which he continues to run with his partner Kara. Harley and Kara have made numerous trips with essential medicines and food for displaced civilians. This Facebook post from November 2022 shows Harley's truck loaded with supplies donated by Lancashire residents bound for the Eastern Front. During the summer of 2023, Harley went to Kosovo, where he enrolled on a course to qualify as an EOD technician. Harley graduated in June 2023 as an EOD technician in humanitarian demining. This Twitter post shows Harley and fellow graduates proudly displaying their EOD technician graduation certificates at MAT in Kosovo. Harley is the second person from the left in the top row. There are two types of mine clearance, military and humanitarian. Military mine clearance is the process undertaken by soldiers to clear a safe path so they can advance during conflict. In this case, mines are only cleared if they block strategic pathways required in the advance or retreat of soldiers at war. Humanitarian mine clearance is very different. It aims to clear land so that civilians can return to their homes and their everyday routines without the threat of explosive hazards. The aim of humanitarian demining is to restore peace and security at the community level. Up to 30% of Ukrainian territory might be contaminated by mines and unexploded ordnance. And about 45% of the fields in regions where fighting occurred were mined by Russian troops. As a result, farmers' work has become deadly dangerous. Harley sources a variety of humanitarian equipment for Ukraine from the UK. He has been instrumental in supplying volunteer combat medic Brandon Mitchell of the Hospitallers Medical Battalion with radios destined for the front lines of Ukraine. Harley frequently travels to the UK to source these radios and demining equipment for the Ukrainian Volunteer Army. Recently, with winter in mind, Harley has sourced and delivered thermal suits for his team of deminers. A recent project is purchase of a 3D printer. This printer will be used to print models of PFM mines to educate school children about the dangers of the mines. PFM mines are Soviet and Russian anti-infantry high explosive mines and are also known as butterfly mines or petal mines. These tiny mines can be deployed from aeroplanes, helicopters and mortars. They glide to the ground without exploding and explode later upon contact. As a self-funded volunteer, Harley depends on donations to carry out his life-saving work in Ukraine. Donations enable him to equip the Ukrainian Voluntary Army D-miners with top-of-the-range D-mining and safety equipment. You can help Harley save more lives in Ukraine by donating to his fundraiser. I'll add links to Harley's official donation channels in the description below. You can donate via PayPal, buy me a coffee and bags. And this is Harley's list of videos on YouTube. I highly recommend his channel for a detailed insight into his life-saving work in Ukraine. This video is based on a recent article I wrote about Harley on the South Coast View website. 
you'll find a lot of articles about the war in Ukraine on South Coast View and I'll also leave a link below to the articles. If you found this video useful, please give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel. I'll see you in the next video.